Well, Ryan, a frustrating game that. You, you did everything you could, but just couldn't find the goal. Yeah, I mean, uh, started both halves quite brightly, to be fair. Um, first half, it was, it was hard for us to play because they were pressing and then we was pressing, so it was a bit like back and forth. But yeah, at half time, like, we got all, all got in the change room, the lads were speaking, Steve spoke, and we said that we need to move the ball quicker. And um, in the second half, <laughs> we'd done everything other than score, to be fair. Um, but yeah, second half performance, I felt like we deserved to get something from the game. As you said, in, in that second half, you certainly played with a lot more velocity about the play and, and you were, you know, you really got at them and were purposeful, weren't you? The goal just wouldn't come, why was that? Yeah, um, I'm not too sure really. We had a couple of shots, but we could have had more. Uh, like Conk got in some good positions myself and then when Reese come on and got some in good, in good, in good some positions as well, so... Uh, I don't know really, we need to practice our shooting maybe, but yeah, it's good. But you, you, you still stuck to the football as well, didn't you? you? You didn't try to force it, you played some really nice passing moves to sort of get those openings. Yeah, I mean, we've been working with Steve and Xavi, and obviously Christian now. Uh, we're trying to play it from the back, we're trying to play more possession football, as some people call it. Uh, but it has been working quite well. I mean, we ain't got off to the best of starts of the season, but you can see in our performances that we are playing well, we are keeping the ball. I just need like the goals to come now. And that's what we need to ask from the strikers and high midfield players. Yeah. There were chances and opportunities. Tell us about the one that you struck um, and it took a deflection and then the keeper saved it with an unusual part of his anatomy, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, I think it hit his head in the end. But um, yeah, the ball just sat up nicely for me. I struck it and took a deflection. Keeper, don't think he knew much about it, but yeah, it's a good save. That sort of summed up the look of the afternoon, didn't it? Yeah, um, not much more to say about it. Like we had all the possession in the second half, and we should have at least got a point. I think we deserved that, and we should pick ourselves up and go again next week. And you all seem to enjoy playing in that system and that, and that style of play as well, don't you? Everyone can find each other with 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 passes and those good rotations. Yeah, I mean we can all play in different positions, and uh, you can see by the rotation in midfield in the first half, like Josh was dropping in, I was going on the left. And then that, that was working, so we stayed. And then you had Conk and Tate rotating in there as well. And it just opens up the game more. And we like to play like that because we can get on the ball, we can turn and look forward. So, yeah, it's, it's a good formation and it's, it's working at the minute. How would you assess the start for the 23 so far and also your own personal displays? Uh, it's been not the best starts and results, but performances haven't been far off uh, like I say, today we played well again. Uh, Charlton, we played well. Ipswich, we played well, and we got the three points. But um, I think the points will come in the end. We just need to stay determined, and I think we'll do all right. And yourself? Yeah, uh, it's been a good start. I mean, went to Wales last week for the 21s. Um, good result against Belgium. Played Germany, not not as good, but um, yeah, I think it's been good. I've been playing quite a lot of games for the 23s as well. So yeah. And you mentioned that international rec- recognition under 21s with Wales. How how big an achievement and how big a thing is that for you? Yeah, I was uh, I was quite proud to get the call up um, it, to the 21s, especially because last year I was with the 19s and it's a step up again. Uh, the 21s is much quicker football. The players are better and you come against better opposition. So I was I was really proud. Yeah. Yeah. What what are the differences? Is it that speed of thought, that extra bit of quality at international level? Yeah, definitely. Um, that was like a lot more technical. Uh, the players move the ball quicker, so you have to be sharper with your with your feet, your movement, and your head. To be fair, to think like what you're going to do next. But other than that, yeah, it's, it's good. Mm-hmm. And you came on in both games, Belgium and Germany, and you you beat Belgium one 0 What what kind of game was that? Yeah, it was a tough game. Uh, we defended well. We scored early on. I think it was the third minute, so we defended well for a good 90 minutes or so. Um, the lads dug deep whole game and it was a very good result to kick off our campaign. And you believe that your involvement in the international scene can be transferred and help you here with the 23s and at Blues? Yeah, definitely. Um, international football is a lot lot quicker, so when you come back here it's like, you can take, not take a step back, but you know what I mean, the, the game, you can get on the ball more, you have more time on the ball so you can find better passes or better like, movements from other players. Hmm. Ryan, thank you very much for your time and unlucky today. Thank you.